Hey guys, it's Cooper with Time Back here. Today I've got the brand new Zan Gold label. Same core, different cover. It's got the 801 Reserve Blend, uh, hit with the Reactor Gloss cover uh, finish. Um, it's nice and shiny. I have this one here at 4,000 grit. Um, I'm really curious to see how similar they are. They both have the pearl cover stocks. They're just poured differently. I have different layouts on them. This has a five inch pin. This one is closer to a Max Flare three and a half inch pin. Um, let's take it on the lanes and see what we can get them to do. So here I've got the original Zen. I'm gonna move way to the right where I started with the Zen Gold label. Ooh. Yeah, initially, my first thought is these balls are two completely different bowling balls. Um, you know, I do have a pretty significant difference in terms of layout. Uh, I have a five inch pin on the one and a three and a half inch pin on the other, but these balls roll significantly different. Um, I don't know if part of that is the fact that the, the track's been beaten up a little bit at this point. It gets, you know, this uh, pair's got quite a few games on it, but uh, yeah, they. The, the gold label is significantly cleaner, and the, the, zen, the zen ball good, as they say, is it's a lot rounder and earlier. Completely different bowling balls. Well, this thing's definitely cleaner than the original zen. Um, it's got the react gloss on it. I have a pretty long pin, five inches is longer for me. I like to keep my stuff in that kind of like three and a half to four inch zone. So uh, it's looking really good going up the board so far. Um, let's take a jump to the left and see what I can get to do. Maybe slow down a little bit. It's kind of like the zone where the, the strokers kind of play. I'm trying to keep my hand a little more behind it. Just trying to keep the, you know, the angles in front of me. So I'm gonna jump to the left and see what we can make it do. This thing's definitely got some bite, uh, even moving left. Uh, I typically play them a little straighter, I'm a little, a little left to where I would normally play the lanes, and it's, this thing is still flying back. I, you know, I did miss right on that last shot, but uh, definitely some cover there. Uh, it kind of shapes like the IQ Ruby. Um, you know, just got that bigger core, so you know, wants a little more action out there on the lanes, but. Once again, just a completely different ball motion. Um, those, those different covers, uh, the React Gloss, like I said, I took my original Zen to 4000 compared to that uh, other Zen with uh, React Gloss on it. They are just completely different motions down lane. Um, I can really see them, though, being good complements to one another. You know, when you start leaving like your flat tens, maybe like your ring tens, you just want a different shape, get a little more entry angle in the pocket. That gold label is going to be a good option. You know. If you have a three ball arsenal, you know, something like the phase two, original Zen, Zen gold label, you know, that'd be a nice one, two, three ladder, you know, game one, game two, game three. Uh, looks really good so far, just completely different than the original Zen. Not a bad thing, just different. All right, so we jumped about five more boards left. Wow.
after taking these out on the lanes, the Zen Gold label is definitely a lot sharper down lane, a lot longer, a lot cleaner. That reactor gloss really, really gets the ball farther down the lane and it makes, it, makes the balls really, really responsive to friction, especially when compared to something like the original Zen. Uh, mine was mine was a factory finish at 4,000, and I keep you know I kind I try to keep up on that surface. Uh, the original Zen is a lot rounder and a lot slower down lane than the Gold Label. I could really really get left and really see that that snap to the left that you can't really see with a lot of balls. It reminds me of an exotic gem, or maybe you know for me at least my IQ Ruby. Those balls were both really clean for me and really angular going into the pocket. I think they're going to be nice complements to one another. Um, you know, like a one, two, three punch might be something like your phase two, your Zen, and then your Zen gold label. They all have similar motions, just slightly, you know, worked off of one another. Where the, where the Zen, I'm sorry, the phase two is going to be the earliest of the three. It's going to be the roundest of the three. It's going to be that start off, that benchmark motion type bowling ball. When you start leaving flat tens or maybe your ring tens, or you just want a different look, the ball down to something like the Zen for game two. You know, you're on a five-man league, uh, ten people on a pair. After a game, there's a lot of breakdown. Um, so that Zen is going to be a nice ball to round that out. Uh, it's going to be a little longer, a little more entry angle into the pocket. And then when the, ball, when the lanes are really, really starting to hook, that's when you can get this bad boy out. Uh, the gold label with that React Gloss cover is really going to get your ball the most entry angle into the pocket. It's a really good look. Um, I really like what 900 Global has done. They don't make a ton of bowling balls, but like I said, they, they don't miss. They, they typically, if they make a bowling ball, it's going to be a hit. And um, man, I, I, I really want to say that it's earned a spot in my bag. Um, I think it's going to be replacing my IQ Ruby. I think, it, I think they do similar things. This one just has a little bit of a bigger core, which for me, as a high tilt, high ball speed player, I typically like those bigger cores just a little bit more than those smaller RG and differential cores like you see in the IQ series. So after throwing it, I threw it about two games. I, I really like the look of the ball. Um, like I said, it's earned a spot in my bag. It's definitely going to be coming to tournaments with me for those, uh, you know, those burn blocks where I really need the ball to just go sideways down lane. So thanks for tuning in, guys. Um, as always, don't forget to like and subscribe. Um, Zen Gold Label comes out soon. comes out in July. Don't forget to look at your local VIP Storm Pro Shop to get yours, or come on over to Tenbeck Pro Shop here in North Canton, Ohio, Park Center Lanes, and see us. We'll get you one punched up, and we'll take care of you. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time.